Hi guys, I am currently in Dubai at the moment. I'm here with Jacob. We just arrived actually this morning. I thought before we messed up our room, I would share with you guys our little hotel room tour. We're staying at um, the Duke of Palms. What? The Palm. Oh, Duke's the Palm. <laughs> I think it's part of like the Royal Hideaway Hotel like group, but yeah, it's called Duke's the Palm. Anyways. Here's a doorway. We've got some closets. <laughs> There's Jacob. <laughs> That's pretty much the room tour, I'm kidding. <laughs> Here's the uh, to uh, bathroom. It's like you can um, make the glass see-through or not, or like tint it. There you go. Um, and then, there's Jacob again. The outside view is not the greatest on this side because it's just construction, but at least we have the ocean view on this side. Jacob and I are actually on our one year anniversary. <laughs> that's what we told reception. Well, actually, that's what, that's what the booking said, and I totally forgot. So when we arrived, they were like, Do you want to switch to a king bed? And I was like, No, <laughs> I'd rather just. <laughs> Jacob was like, Yeah, we hate each other. <laughs> so yeah, now we're just pretending to be like a couple on our one year anniversary, which is tomorrow. <laughs> I bought a little something at um, Heathrow Airport. So I'm really happy that I saw it at Heathrow for obviously tax free. I was gonna say don't bother with the box, but the box is so pretty this year. The box is so pretty, I can resist. Anyways, here we can do this with one hand. This is the little belt bag with a pouch. Oops. In the blue oblique. They also had like the saddle shaped version of this with the belt but that one fit literally nothing inside, like not even my phone, at least this one fit my phone. Okay, so I'm looking a lot better now. Sorry about my appearance earlier, honestly. I don't need to apologize for my appearance, but like honestly, earlier I was like looking at myself in viewfinder and I'm like, that is not okay. <laughs> Anyways, I still haven't taken my pigtails out yet because I want to wait till like the very last minute, but we did just go downstairs, I downed an iced coffee, like when I say downed, I literally downed it. And I feel so much better now. I had a Caesar salad and a potato soup, so I'm also filled. <sighs> Plus I got my makeup on, got a pre-dress on, so I'm feeling much more myself now. Jacob is actually just in the shower. He's getting ready. This is my outfit for this afternoon. I am wearing my Bistro Village um, score the other day by Gucci with the ladybugs. I love this dress so pretty. And then I'm gonna be wearing my Chanel slides and then this um, backpack. But actually, we're going to go camel riding this afternoon. I know it's like we literally just got here, <laughs> but because we don't have a lot of days and it just made sense um, or easiest for us to go camel riding tonight or this afternoon, we are going because that's just how our plans worked out. My highlight is looking really cute in the viewfinder, at least. I hope. Yeah, you see that? It's, I'm wearing um, Trophy Wife by Fenty. I thought something gold would be nice for the desert. I just threw on this Balenciaga scarf to cover up a little bit, and yeah, I'm ready to go. Jacob's ready with his little outfit and backpack. You're ready to go camping, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> I love his sunglasses, by the way. That's him shying away from the camp scare. <laughs> I finally took my braids down. I think we're just trying to kill time, to be honest. <laughs> Jacob's changed his pants like three times. I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. You just got talking about the right foot. Oh, we did it. We just stopped over quick. We were supposed to have a longer layover, but we had to leave. Very confident yeah, in driving this. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> Sorry, Kim. He's concentrating. sacrifice <laughs> somebody. This is fun. <laughs> so we've just stopped at a random spot for photo break, I believe. 
was the bumpiest and most fun roller coaster car ride of my life. <laughs> oh, this is great lighting. <laughs> Michigan, where we're at. We have dune buggy rides. But it's like one of these wow. animals that you go off. Not like an entire <laughs> desert. It looks like a school bus. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> and they go down the hills backwards. Yeah. We just got to the camel riding place. There's some ATT going on here. We're having our sex in the city moment. <laughs> So we just took some photos with the camels and now we're just walking around. Apparently we're here for a couple hours. Then they have like hookah and like henna, henna tattooing. The weather is actually so perfect right now, isn't it? Yeah. Cause it's like nice and windy, but it's warm. How beautiful these carpets are. Oh, there's a purple one. <laughs> it changes color, so it's like a darker purple. Oh no, that's a darker purple. Dark? Yeah. And light. Wow. Very pretty. It's Jacob's favorite color. This is the dark. Oh no, this is even darker. Okay. Keep getting it wrong. <laughs> Red. Beautiful. Red. Look how gorgeous this, this carpet, carpet is. This size wow. is 120 by 170 size. So look beautiful. This side, okay. And look this side. Like. This one's beautiful. This one? Yeah. Yes, this two by three meter big size. This is a runner, one meter by two meter. <laughs> We're gonna attempt to do sandboarding. Well, Jacob's gonna go first, and then I'm gonna see if I am brave enough to do it. Trudging through the desert. <laughs> Owie. <laughs> he, I don't know if you guys heard, but he said it seems kind of steep from here. And he doesn't know what he's doing. It's fine. You got it. Maybe you can just sit like this dude here. Um, Woohoo! <laughs> it's going a bit slow, no? Is, is it fun? <laughs> I just got a corn to try. I love corn, guys. It's my favorite. So it's like a sweet corn. Mmm. It's good. We're just waiting for our driver to come now because we want to leave. <laughs> We're tired. It's home time. <coughs> We're back at the hotel now. <laughs> yeah, you have to lean down low for me. I'm just walking in to have some dinner. Kai Bar. I think it's an Indian restaurant. Hello. How are you? Jacob looking dapper. Thank you so much. Jacob is so keen for dinner. Korma, butter chicken. Thank you so much. Good morning guys. I've just finished getting ready. We're just heading down to the pool to chill at the pool slash beach for a little bit. Just a little morning swim before we start the day. Today we're going to an amusement park, um, which I'll let you guys know more about later. I thought I'd quickly show you guys what I'm wearing down to the pool. Sorry, there's a pillow on the floor. <laughs> I'm wearing this really old um, ASOS bikini. I love the polka dots there. <laughs> and the matching bottoms. And then I've just wrapped a Versace scarf 
um, around. And that's pretty much it. I'm wearing my Design Exchange sunglasses as well. So we've made it to the pool area. It's super quiet this morning. There's nobody around except us. Jacob just gone to get towels. And then that couple there, but... Oh yeah, here's a view of the hotel from the outside. The sun's not quite out yet. It's gonna come out later, but we're gonna go to amusement park later, so we're just gonna take advantage of the pool now for a bit. At least the pool's uh, heated, so it's actually quite warm. Anyways. So we just got back to the room, took a quick shower and got changed and we're going to go downstairs for a quick breakfast breakfast, <laughs> and then go to a Motion Gate um, theme park. Jacob has been itching to go, he is a huge fan of theme parks. I, I'm excited but I'm just scared because um, when I was younger I used to be much more like excited for rides and now I'm just like terrified so we'll see how I get along today. But this is my outfit. I've got my Prada body on from Bister Village. These are Zara jeans, high-waisted jeans. I'm wearing my um, Dior shoes. These are like literally my go-to everyday walking shoes. They're so, so, so comfortable. I'm gonna have to replace these when, or probably soon actually, because they're pretty battered up. And then I'm using my new little um, waist bag from Dior because I think it'll just be easy to walk around and then I'm just gonna swing this camera over my shoulder anyways. Um, I'm gonna bring this scarf with me just in case I need to cover up a little bit. But that's pretty much it. Oh, and I'm wearing, I'm wearing my new Chanel sunglasses. My hair's just up right now because I don't want to deal with it. It's a little bit wet, but I'll take it down later. And Jacob's looking cute. Love the outfit. You ready? Time for some breakfast. Looks amazing. Definitely one of my favorite sections, the cheese. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is very similar to Chinese. This looks like it's very similar to Chinese Tong Yoping. It's my favorite. Yum. There's some pastries here. Although my favorite donuts are just like the glazed donuts. Anyone else the same? Hash browns is another fave. And then some more hot foods. There's a lot. Morning! This is like the crepe, sorry. And the waffle section. Amazing. <gasps> Pancakes. <laughs> Yum. I got a whole plate of assorted things. And an omelette. And some beans. And Jacob pretty much got the same. I feel like we're pretty similar with what we chose. No? I'm excited for this mango juice though. I'm waiting for my almond latte. Bon appetit. Dig in. Excited? <laughs> I'm a bit stuffed for breakfast, from breakfast, so... Oh, goodness. Let's see how this goes. First stop, Columbia Pictures. We actually already walked in. I ran out just to show you guys the sign. <laughs> it's super empty today, which is a good thing because it means there's no lines. But, um, just doesn't feel like a theme park unless there's, like, loads of people. Look, there's, like, nobody. Right, which ride should we go on? I can do that. I can do that. <laughs> Alright, let's go. We've made it to Smurf Village. I love these mushrooms. Jacob looks so cute here. <laughs> he wants me to go on the giant drop. I'm just, I can't. I just can't do it. Are there any rides here though? Yeah. Where? 
Okay. Okay, well you walk ahead because you look cute in here with your little stripy shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Can you see yourself? Are you I in it? Oh yeah, I'm <laughs> Dreamworks. Oh, it's spinning the other way now. <laughs> <laughs> Lionsgate is the last one. The Hunger Games one is here. Yeah, that giant. It's not that giant. It doesn't look that giant from here now, actually. Oh, I don't know. Okay, I guess I'll do it. What was your favorite ride, Jacob? Mm, the dragon one. The dragon one? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Mine was Madagascar. Okay. Yeah, that one was a good ride. I did end up going on the Hunger Games ride. The, the scary one. I just want to put it, that out there. <laughs> I braved myself. I'm still not going the giant drop though. That's still a no. <laughs> Jacob, what do you rank or rate this park out of 10? Uh, like a 6.5, I reckon. You think? Yeah, what do you reckon? Yeah, like a 6. <laughs> Jacob and I just got back to our room, and remember how I said yesterday we told them it was our one year anniversary? How cute! Dear Mr. and Mrs. Ewington, congratulations with your recent wedding celebration. <laughs> I am dying, so. <laughs> what is this? Just, it's a cake. <laughs> Happy Mrs. anniversary, Mrs. babe! <laughs> okay. Oh, what is that? Hey, you're gonna wipe the Stop that. <laughs> no, don't get away. No, okay, I'm done. That was fun. So we're on our way to the Burj Khalifa. I have changed my outfit. I'm wearing a full, no, not full. It's just like Louboutin is top and necklace. And I'm wearing these Zara pants, I believe. Either Zara or Topshop, I think Zara. But um, I wanted to, I forgot, I was gonna say this yesterday, but something that I noticed about Dubai, which I did not know about before, is um, there's no red lights here. There's no traffic lights, which I find so interesting. It's like the first city I've ever visited that doesn't have like red lights. Did I mention this yesterday, actually? I know I mentioned it to you, but I don't know if I mentioned it to the vlog. I know it's really interesting. I remember being in the car yesterday, and I was like, wait, we haven't stopped us like at all. Anyways, I thought I'd share that. <laughs> We're just looking for tickets online. Everything seems like obviously as per, everything seems um, cheaper online to book than buying it there. So, I'm a bit tired now as you can tell, but I'm gonna push through. <laughs> oh my God, I swear that's like the first red light <laughs> I've seen in Dubai. And the camera looks like the sky is purple. It's definitely not purple, but maybe that's just my eyes. <laughs> it's a Dubai mall. Well, it's nice and cool outside now. So we just stood on this structure right in front of the mall. And here's a better view. Oh, oh here's Jacob helping people take photos. <laughs> Wow, we there's a massive fountain in front. So yeah, I love the weather out right now. It's really nice. Um, kind of want to take pictures here, but it's so crowded. This guy is like pulling Jacob around to help take a photo. <laughs> It's like the tenth photo he's taken of him. Are you done taking photos of strangers? Yeah. Cute. I finally got him the photo. He 
Jacob, you're too tall. <laughs> Wait, let's get a little selfie of us behind in front of it. <laughs> great shot, great angle. Hey, look, there's a Ding Tai Fung here. <laughs> We're still trying to work out how to get up there. I mean, obviously, just get into the building and then we'll see with the tickets. But we were thinking like if there was like a dinner place up there or is it just a viewpoint? We don't know. Also, I love this lip color on me. I'm wearing Kat Von D. Forgot the name of it, I'll put it up on the screen, but it makes me look tan. Okay, so how do we get from here to over there is the question. We really should have done our research earlier and like worked out how to do this earlier, but we're just kind of winging it. <laughs> Here's a better look at my outfit for tonight. These pants look like it's falling apart. They're Zara for you. <laughs> I've worn these like three times or twice even. Anyways. Oh, I yeah. Okay, looks like we found it at the top, Burj Khalifa. It's back in the mall, basically. I mean, tip of the day, read signs, guys. <laughs> we just completely ignored the signs and just like followed where the building was. Oh my gosh, the lighting is so horrible, sorry. Let's do Jacob's face. <laughs> Here we go, at the top, Burj Khalifa. Although, we're none of these, we don't have tickets at all so just reading fun facts on our ticket this one says if weigh the total amount of concrete used in the construction of the Burj Khalifa would equal to approximately a hundred thousand elephants fitting for me to get this ticket <laughs> and Jacob says Burj Khalifa's design embodies the lyrical and well proportioned structure of the oh gosh Kimeno that word. How do you pronounce this? Hibernoculus or the spider lily. Interesting. Also, we just learned it will take us exactly 77 seconds to get up to the 128th floor. And then we have to switch elevators to get to whatever floor we're getting to. 150 something. 12,000 workers and 20 million man hours during the project. Six years of construction. So we're on the 148th floor right now. And there's the view of Dubai. Guys, I love witnessing surprise proposals that literally just teared me up. Someone just got proposed to. It was the cutest thing ever. Anyway, we're on the 148th floor. And the view up here, I mean, it's like, it's cool, but I hate the glare of the window, but obviously like they need that there obviously, but as you can tell, you can see the freaking like oil marks of people's hands, which bother me. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just looking for Jacob now, so you guys can't see me, but I think it's so cute they just got like engaged. I literally teared up. <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> Okay, I'm going in. So we just had dinner, we had KFC. <laughs> but I have to try KFC everywhere I go. Because um, I love popcorn chicken so much. The best, po the, best popcorn chi the best popcorn chicken is still in Vietnam, though in my opinion. I've tried a lot of popcorn chicken in my lifetime. Anyways, we're walking towards the fountain now because I think in like five minutes, there's gonna be a fountain show. Oh. Look at these really cool lights on the um, Burj Khalifa. All right, okay, it stopped. <laughs> well, I'm glad I caught the last like two seconds of that, but we're waiting for the fountain to go on. We're in our element right now, trying to decide 
on oil-based perfume, oil -based correct? Perfume. Yeah. Jacob found a bottle that he likes. It's the most, one of the more expensive ones. <laughs> <laughs> I love these ones here. So pretty. The only problem with these ones is they have, they're, um, they don't have as much um, space for perfume in there, basically. This is like, this is 12 mil, right? Sure. And there's only like three in there. Um, so you can imagine there's like nothing in there. But the bottle is so pretty. I love the vanilla scent. There's like so many to pick from. So now we're just deciding, Jacob, you like this one, right? Yeah. What's this one again? It's called Dubai. Du Dubai name. Uh -huh. It's a blend of uh, some old rose. Wooden rose. <laughs> Look at how pretty the bottles are. Imagine filling that up with perfume. Yay! We finally made our decisions. I went with the bigger bottle, the 6 mil one with the vanilla. Mm -hmm. And then Jacob went with this bottle here um, with the Dubai scent. You happy with yourself? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I could spend hours in here smelling everything. Thank you. Jacob's deciding on this backpack because the discount is so good. The price is 1,144 dirham, which is like 200 and something pounds. Let me check. It's like 237 pounds for that backpack. So good. The discount in here is 70 to 75% off. Check out this shirt. I love it. I'm not going to get it, but it's a great price. 357. So obviously when you're at this mall, you got to check out the massive aquarium. It's stunning. Oh my god, can you go up there? Look at that one. What a cutie. Actually, I hate fish, but like when it's in an aquarium, it's fine. Look at that beast. That's a beast. There's a couple beasts there. I'm talking like I've never seen an aquarium before. But I've never seen an aquarium in a mall. That's new. It's home time. <laughs> Anyways, it's home time. We need to sleep. I'm actually feeling peckish, which is dangerous because it's 11.30. We need to sleep. Good morning, guys. We are on our way to um, the Souk traditional market at the moment. I love our outfits together today, by the way. Um, today's our last day. And yeah, it's nice and sunny out. It's like the hottest day, I feel like, right? Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, like since we've been here, I mean. Anyways, look at Jacob's outfit, cute. I am bedazzled today. I'm like really extra with my sunnies and my earrings, but yeah, I'm really excited to see the traditional area of Dubai. We just made it to the gold souk. First thing I realized is they're very pushy here. I didn't. Even, we didn't even get out of the freaking taxi yet, and we were like bombarded with like Louis Vuitton bags. Apparently, they wanted to sell me. Anyways. Wow, look at this market. Where do we even go? Probably that way. Guys, look how intense these body pieces are. So beautiful. That's like low key now compared to that. <laughs> Ooh, some pretty shoes. Wow, look at these ones. Oh my god. <gasps> That is so cute. Jacob. <laughs> I am. This is adorable. <laughs> Looking at some spices. Ooh, traffic. Hello. Oh my gosh. Continuing our souk adventure. Thank you. <laughs> No, I'm good, thank you. Smell this one is raw lemon. Amazing. I'm from Taiwan. <laughs> thank you. So we've made our way back to more perfumes. We can't get enough of these. I like this bottle. I found a perfume called Scandal. Not Scandal. Sandal. <laughs> there, Sandal. This smells amazing. Reminds me of something Loewe would have. 
We found a map like right at the end of our souk adventure <laughs> um, of all the souks. Look at that. Um, herbs, historical, mattress, perfume. Oh, there's a whole perfume souk. Was that the one we were just in? Yeah. Textile, utensils. Oh, it actually was. <sighs> Anyways, check out the map before you guys go in. Oh, sorry. <laughs> We're about to take one of these boat taxis to cross the water to the other side. Let's see how this is gonna go. Hopping onto the boat now. Honestly, we don't know where we're going. He just said go, so we're going. Just following people, you know? <laughs> oh, actually, I love that we accidentally decided to do this because this is such an amazing view of Dubai, I feel like. So we made it to another souk, apparently. <laughs> we just followed the crowd, basically. They're a little bit more handsy here. The other place, they were just like, loved asking questions. This one, they like to grab you. If I lived here, I would get some of these cushions. These little bean bag things are so pretty. So I'm a little bit embarrassed because I was asking the taxi driver earlier where we can go find like a tradi traditional like Arabian tea place to sit down and have some tea basically and I thought he like said like oh sorry there's a freak ton of birds anyways um I thought he said like some sort of Arabic word like Arabian tea or something like that <laughs> so I wrote it down on my phone like the way I thought it would be spelt so I remember how to say it again but I just showed Jacob and he <laughs> He started laughing because the guy just meant Arabian tea house. I wrote like A R B I A N T Y or something like that. Some like random ass word. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. She just had a bit of a laugh. Anyways, now I think we're on our way to find an Arabian tea house. <laughs> okay, we've come. To, I don't know where we are, but we're just following the arrows now. Well, that was the last arrow. <laughs> we're just gonna keep going. We've just been wandering around this part of Old Town. And I just love how all the buildings are these gorgeous, like, accru, like, beige color. All the buildings. Still looking for that um, traditional tea house, by the way. So pretty here. Okay, so we still haven't found this tea place yet. <laughs> We've literally been walking around an hour looking for it now, but we're enjoying this walk. It's really beautiful weather today, especially underneath this. It's nice and cool. I still have faith we're gonna find this tea place. Yeah. Oh, look at that. It's like, look at this random things like you'd see. Like, I love that. Okay, so we found this little place, which looks really, really cute. We were trying to find something where you sit on the floor and chill, but this place looks really nice as well. It's super cute. Hi. I love this vibe. <laughs> okay, let's see. By the way, this is where we're at. So I think I just ordered, oh, I just asked them what they recommended. I wanted Arabic tea and then just said this is their like special here. So let's see. Try it, Jacob. Oh, it's hot. We can't try it yet. <laughs> so we've got a couple snacks. We just got hummus, obviously. Jacob got some falafels. And then we're gonna share some um, cheese samosas. <laughs> and of course, the pita bread. So this is where we just had our little snack. And they actually also have an outdoor little sitting space there, which is cute. Hey guys, so I'm back in London now. Uh, my plane landed at like 6.30 in the morning and I Ubered home and immediately 
crashed in bed and slept for several hours. It's now like 3 p.m. I think and I just I'm just getting my day, my day started so yeah <laughs> I thought I'd end the vlog obviously I'm back in London now so this is the end of my Dubai vlog but before I do um, I thought I would end the vlog by sharing with you guys the carpet that I bought. I know I shared it already when I was buying it but I thought I'd share with you guys where I put it when I was buying it, I already knew I wasn't really sure where I would put this carpet because of the color and how vibrant it is. It doesn't really go with anything. The only other place I can put it is in my front hall kind of um, area. But I don't know. I just, I think this carpet, the, the vibrancy of the color is just too much for out there as well. So I've put it in my closet for now. Um, obviously, it's also very busy to have this with all the clothes and stuff. But um, I am moving in the foreseeable future anyway, so I will find a proper spot for this um, carpet. All I knew is I really wanted it. I loved it. I love the color. It's just so beautiful. I don't fall in love with carpets very often. Um, of course, also, I'm just not at a point where I'm willing to spend a fortune on them because obviously carpets are so expensive and this one was very, very affordable and it's so stunning. I mean, I just can't believe I lugged this whole thing back. I mean, bear in mind, when it folds up, it folds up quite small, but still. I also still stuck with my um, carry-on limits, so I never had to check anything in. I, pardon me, lugged everything back on carry-on, so yeah, that was a plus. Anyways, okay, I'm going to go unpack now, start my day, and I will see you guys in my next vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Give it a thumbs up if you guys did. Leave any comments you guys have down below. Um, subscribe and hit the bell button if you guys haven't already. Um, and I'd love to catch up with you next time. So yes, speak to you guys soon. Bye.